morning, everybody. Feverdini here, and welcome to Supermarket Simulator. Now, I don't know why this game has gotten really popular over the last couple of days. I've been seeing a lot of TikToks and YouTube videos about it, so let's just go ahead and see just why it's so entertaining. Except I already have! Did you notice this continue button being lit up? Yeah, I played it, recorded it, and actually ended up deleting the footage. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I cried myself to sleep that night. But anyways, what we're gonna go ahead and do, we're gonna go ahead, create another new game. And with the knowledge I obtained from the other session, I'm gonna go back in and be a freaking amazing, the best supermarket owner on the block. Can I do it by the end of this video? Let's see how far I get. But anyways, um, actually, yeah. So when I did play this game, this game is actually pretty gosh darn fun. Not fun, but relaxing and stressful, very stressful, at least the way that I play it. I feel like I play it a little too, yeah. <laughs> Anyways, let's go ahead, buy some oil. In the very beginning, it doesn't really matter what you get, honestly. Well, it probably will, but actually, I, I feel like I claimed that I, I, I played this before, but um, I, I still feel like a novice, not gonna lie. <laughs> Oh, but I do know the basics. Um, not gonna lie, the first store I made, guys, was a bit of a mess. It's sad that you guys can't see it, but also good at the same time. Um, we're gonna go ahead and make that market price five buckaroonies. Um, last time I actually undercharged everything <laughs> and we're open for business. But this time I learned my lesson. We're going to be, hello, welcome to Nina Markets. Hopefully you enjoy our oil. Oh yeah, she likes that oil. <laughs> but yeah, like last time I like overcharged everything. Thank you. Um, oh yeah, I also found out the hard way that you can't underprice them. You can't give them no change. Like you can't be like, here, they're, they're gonna be mad about that. So instead, <laughs> you gotta give them the right amount of change. We're ethical no here at this store, guys. We may only sell um oil but we're very ethnical. Maybe the oil is overpriced too, maybe, probably, but we are good. We are awesome, we are the, why did you give me a $50 bill for $5? You know what, he probably just needs some change. I got you, no, no harm in that, no harm in that. Anyways, everyone's coming in for Nina's oil. Yes, everyone purchase the oil, enjoy the oil, lather it all over your skin. Oh, thank you, come again. You want some oil too? Everybody wants that good sweet oil. Oh wait, that was a card. Awesome. Anyways, um, now that we got some more Mulano, let's go ahead and start getting more stuff in our little humble supermarket. Um, right now, I guess we have enough to get some cereal. No, we're gonna do bread. I want two rows of every, freak. No, I don't want three things of bread. That's a little too much. Anyways, we're gonna go ahead and get two things of bread. Oh, customer. Oh, the customers are piling up. Everybody really wants that sweet oil, guys. But yeah, we also need to diversify a little bit so that when people come in, they don't just get one piece of oil. They get one oil and something else. So now we got the bread. I needed to do all that, guys. I had to roll my R for that. I had to because the bread, oh, the bread is special. Wait, wait, lady, give me a un momento, por favor. I'm stocking up, stocking up. Do you? Would you be interested in some good quality, high, overcharged piece of bread. Would you be into that? She's into the overpriced bread! Oh my gosh. <laughs> Not gonna lie, I do feel bad though about that because if I actually like, oh man, like I'm trying to like level up my store as fast as possible. And in order to do that, I do need to like charge it up a little bit. Like market price is like 350. I gotta charge it up to four. I'm I'm sorry. I'm sorry, guys. Anyways, we got a little bit more money. Cause the more money you get, the more you're able to like increase like buying other stuff. Like for example, I'm gonna go ahead and get some flour. I'm gonna get some sugar and we can not afford that. Can somebody buy something real quick? Nice. Yes. Yes. You will do nicely. Thank you. Thank you very much, ma'am. Okay, there you go. And we got another customer. I love the suit. I never mind. I hate the suit. Why didn't you grab some bread too? Come on, help me out here. 
It's fine. Thank you for your five dollars. I know it, it's I feel like everything is just so overpriced right now. <laughs> ah, I'm sorry. Inflation hits. But now we're able to afford flour and sugar. Let's go ahead and pop these bad boys on the shelf. Ooh, I gotta hurry up and change the prices before she touches my sugar. Don't touch my sugar! Five dollars! Okay, she didn't touch the sugar. Cause they can like, they can buy the sugar at like a low price if you don't set the price. That sounds bad, but we can't let them do that. Hey, you got that sugar! You like that sugar? The sugar is popular, guys. I'm happy that we got it. Anyways, let's go ahead, continue stocking up while people are coming in. Already, I'm doing so much better compared to like the last time I played this. Um, just because the first time when I was playing it, I was mess not gonna lie, I was messing around a lot. I sold the sugar at like two dollars, thinking that people was gonna come in for the sugar and get other stuff while they're there, but no. No, they don't they don't do that. They don't do that. Thank you for your patronage. Have an amazing day. Awesome. Awesome. And then also last time when I was playing, I made the bread like $10, thinking that people might actually come in and buy it. No, nah, they complained. They complained to my manager, which is me. They asked for the manager. I pulled up. Like, hey. I'm sorry, I'll, I'll lower my prices. Not gonna lie, if I was a manager, I would 100% do that. <laughs> like, I I suck at confrontation. So that's why I don't think I'll ever really be a manager at any place. Like, I remember I could have, like, when I was working at McDonald's, like, I had the ability to be a manager. I remember someone, like, op asking me, hey, would you actually want to train to be a manager? And I was like... No, <laughs> I can't manage nobody. And honestly, if a customer came and like asked me, oh, uh, I need a refund because of this, this, that, I'll just give it to them. I would, I would just give it to them. I would lose all the money in the world, honestly. Awesome. Oh, you got two things of oil. You must really be into that oil. We got the best oil here. Quality over quantity at the Neiman Market, guys. Quality over quantity. Okay, now we cannot afford. We can we can barely afford. No, we can't. I mean, it's two buckaroonies. Anybody want to give me some money for some cereal? Cereal money? Come on, guys. Come inside. The store is open. Get in my store. Get in my store. <laughs> Why do I feel like he gave me the side eye just now? Okay, and after this, we'll be able to afford. Oil is too expensive. Excuse you, I have you know, my oil is shipped fresh from... Where does oil come from? <laughs> oh my gosh, 16 buckaroonies, I love it. But yeah, where does oil come from? I actually don't even know. Oh, thank you, awesome, awesome. Hey, 18 buckaroonies. You paid a hundred dollars for that? <laughs> I mean, I get it. You only, if you only got $100 bills, I get it. Thank you for supporting me. But like, dang, dang, man, that just surfed up, surfaced up old memories of when I was like a cashier person. Oh my gosh. Whenever. Oh, thank you for coming in. Anytime I had to get a $100 bill, it made me so nervous. Be like, is this real? Like, is this a real $100 bill? Oh man, like I know they have the marker, but sometimes the like there was no markers. So I would have to, oh, the day's finished. Okay, let's just go ahead and set up for tomorrow. We'll be able to afford two things of cereal. We can get two things of pasta. And I think that's all we're missing from this catalog. And we might need to restock more oil. They love the oil, guys. They love the oil. And I might just put one thing of oil. Yeah, I think I might be able to afford that for tomorrow, right? Uh, two cereal, one oil, and two pasta. Yeah, I can afford that tomorrow. Awesome! Let's go ahead and finish up the day! Oh, man. One unsatisfied customer over here being like, it's too expensive. I mean, I'm ashamed of my prices as well, guys. Don't look at me like that. Anyways, now it seems like we have bills to pay. We got bills to pay. So let's go ahead and first... oil. so expensive oh wait four things of that no that's not what i wanted to do but i did want to get mm, let's go one down okay we're gonna buy that right now 
And something I actually didn't notice the first time I played this, the day doesn't start until I open. So I can actually have time to set up. Before, I was like literally running, like like acting like I was running a marathon. They're like, I gotta hurry and open this door. And this is that. Yeah, time does not move until I turn, I, I open the store, which is actually really good to know. Like I actually have time to set everything up. Ooh. Anyways, what was I saying? I feel like I was saying something and then I was like, it's the end of the day. Probably nothing important. Anyways. No! Why? <laughs> oh my God. You were not supposed to go down there, freak. How do I... Oh. I actually did not know how to remove that. Oh, I'm so happy. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Okay, so this is what we're working with. So we got seven buckaroonies. Let's go ahead and open. Hello, would you like some food? Yay! Let's go ahead. Oh, you're selling a... No, oh my gosh, no, no, no. You're selling a product without setting a price. No. That means they got it for the cheap. Oh, no, we can't have that. Dangs it. Dangs it. Let's see how much money they got from that. <laughs> Let's see how much we're selling it for. Thank you. Thank you for your patronage. Thank you. Thank you. What about you? How much is this pasta? 99 cents. Man, you're lucky. You're lucky that I was doing marketing and I was distracted. Don't look down. Yeah, look at me. You're lucky I was outside doing marketing. I couldn't set my prices. He's ashamed. I know he is. Just kidding. He knows he got a good deal. He knows he got a good deal. Dang. I should just give you nothing but pennies to be petty. But you know what? I'm not like that. I'm not I'm not a petty person, guys. Thank you for your patronage. 22 macaroonies. I love it. I love you. Please come again another day. Okay. And now that uh, we have bills to pay, we have to come over here to the bill section. Just kidding. There's no bills to be paid today. Another day. Anyways, um, so yeah, now we have to rack up 200 buckaroonies to get more products in my store. 11 bucks. Noise. Oh, wait. Did, 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 did I give her too much money? Why did they give me that tutorial? <laughs> wait, wait. <laughs> oh, no. I hope that I didn't just, like, give her, like, extra money. Because you can't give them less money, but you can give them extra money. I don't know why, but... I guess this is a very- No! Oh my gosh! I just realized I just did- Why am I like this? Oh my gosh. Okay, I just did it again. I looked at the total and I gave him the change for the total instead of the change. Hey, my guy. Welcome to the Nina- Oh my gosh, everyone's bringing in cash. They know my mistake. They know my mistake and they're like, we heard that we're gonna get cash back. No! That promotion is done. Oh my gosh. Man, note to self. I don't know if I could ever really have a supermarket. Not gonna lie, guys. Like, already, I'm like fumbling the bag. Thank you, thank you. Everything's overpriced. People, people are getting money that they, that, 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 <laughs> that they don't even, like, whatchamacallit. it? Hi. Welcome to the star. Okay, so we have $76. I don't think I can afford anything right now. Hello! Thank you, thank you! And I'm gonna go ahead and a blink. Awesome! Um, actually, what I wanna do, something that I wanted to do last time, but I wasn't sure about, I'm gonna get a loan. I'm gonna get a loan and I'm gonna set it uh return payment. We're gonna we're gonna give us 25 days to pay it back. 750 buckaroonies, let's take the loan. Goodness gracious. <laughs> oh, this actually makes I actually have never gotten a loan before in, in real life. So that actually makes me kind of nervous. Oh gosh. That's you use a hundred dollar. Where are these people getting these hundred dollar bills? They must be loaded. Yeah, there we go. Oh yeah. So I haven't gotten a loan before. So I, I, I even in real life, because I'm scared to not pay it back. Oh, 0. 0.50. At least they tell you. Um, but now I'm gonna go ahead and just do that this time to see what I can do with that. And see if I can speed things up a little bit more. But now we can purchase the product license. And also we can purchase, um, we can purchase a refrigerator. I think that's the next thing they're going to tell me to do, right? Seven buckaroonies coming right up. Oh, wait, turn on the lights. <laughs> what? I already turned on the lights. But yeah, now they're going to tell me to get a coming right up. Boop, boop. There you go. 
and it's $12 back. This time, no more extra money. Okay, guys? Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Four buckaroos. Oh my gosh, I almost did it again. Ah, you get no money back. Oh my gosh. Okay, let me hurry up and get the, the, the fridge before um before it gets past 9 o'clock. I think 9 o'clock is when everything shuts down. Yeah, I'm gonna get a big fridge. Yes. Yes. Oh, oh, snap. Hi. <laughs> Thank you for your money. Thank you for your patriots. Exact change. <laughs> so... This is not, I'm sorry, this is not a Mr. B store where we give you money for just shopping at our, at our, at a store. Oh my gosh, imagine. If I could afford that, I would, in a heartbeat. But, I can't. Life, it's hard out here, guys. It's hard out here, you know? Anyways, looking great. Looking awesome. Thank you for your Mulano. <laughs> Come again another day. Awesome. Man, we are locked and loaded. We're doing so amazing right now, guys. Like, honestly. Like, compared to my first try, like, I think it took a, took me, like, four, five days to even get anything started. But I think with the addition... Oh, yeah, $50. I thought I was seeing stuff. I gotta be careful. 50 cents. Oh gosh, I really gotta be careful. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Before I just give them the total. I promise, when I was a cashier, guys, I did not do this. I did not do this. I promise. I was a little bit more careful because I was scared of giving away money. <laughs> awesome. Awesome. People are coming in. This is awesome. Everything's awesome up until I have to start paying back that loan. Then it won't be so awesome. Thank you. Thank you for your patronage and it's almost time to close up for the day um yeah five o'clock on the dot uh or sorry eight o'clock nine o'clock hey people are still coming in hi welcome welcome and i think i still got a box of pasta just chilling outside will someone steal that oh snap it's full um we'll, we'll just put you over here hey thank you you're the last customer for the day thank you thank you for why are you using <laughs> I really do feel like people just coming in here to get the change. To get their change. Oh my gosh. You know what? It's fine. All that. Oh, people are still people are coming in? Everyone's coming in with suits. Is there a fancy outing today that I should be, you know, that I should know about? Hello. There you go. Thank you. Thank you. Ten buckaroonies. Awesome. Oh my gosh. Let me not undercharge. Goodness gracious. Yeah, I should not. I don't think I should get a supermarket at this point. Anyways, day is finished. <laughs> Store level income. I'm kind of scared. I like how they said I'm in the negative with my profit. But pretty soon, pretty soon next day. Oh, pasta went up. Tea went down. So I think I can charge. I'm going to keep it. I'm going to keep it 350 no inflation at this store yet. <laughs> I know I literally just started off by saying inflation. Okay, but now we can go ahead and afford new products. So let's go ahead and stock up. We're gonna get two things of water, two things of cheese, two things of coffee, two things, two things, two things of everything. Noise, water, cheese, uh, coffee, eggs, milk, and tea. Wow maxed out my total um how much money do i have 360 i am kind of scared about that but why is coffee 111 dollars dang oh my heart oh maybe i should pay my bills before i start getting all this stuff wait what is my bills okay and then and then my loan do i pay my loan today pay off early do they just take it out number of payments left 24 days um i, I think they just take it out right I think they just take it out they just they just take it out payments just kidding it's right here oh my gosh i was about to be late for my payment pay my 37 dollars awesome awesome now let's see the mayhem outside awesome okay we got milk let me just go ahead and stock this up real quick Oh my gosh, there's like not even, you can't even take it back. You can't even take it back. Oh my freaking goodness, guys. That is so bad. But anyways, this is what the store is looking like, guys. Um, <laughs> I made a couple mistakes, but let's go ahead and open for the day.
We only got like $15 to our name right now. Come one, come all to the greatest experience of your life called the Nina Market. I don't know if I should change that name, guys. Honestly, if I make an, you guys let me know if I should make another video about this, honestly. And give suggestions for what name I should name my supermarket. Hey, look at all this stuff you got. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for your support. Awesome. We love to see it. We love to see it. And nobody has complained so far. But yeah, what was I saying? Yeah. Okay, so I would uh, definitely comment down below a name that I should name this place. And if I play it again, I will use your comment to give this place a name. I don't know. Like, you guys are a lot more creative. Than what do you mean milk is too expensive? No. No, no, no. I price my things very affordable. This is literally 60, 60 cents over our max axing price. Okay, it is a little expensive. I'm sorry. I just kind of like even numbers as well. I I'm sorry. I'm sorry you didn't like my expensive milk. I just like even numbers. And if it's like, I either round down or, or like, sorry, I round up as in if it's 0.40, I'll round up to 50. But if it's like point, you're right. You're right. It's too expensive. Too expensive. Sorry. Sorry. With that logic, I should have made it just a little bit. There's a little bit. This is what I meant, though. <laughs> this is what I meant. This is $4. I like even numbers, you know? Thank you, thank you. And that is, yeah. Exact change. We love people who give a jack change. That was English. Don't, 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 don't ask if that was English or not. That was 100% English. Thank you. Couldn't find tea. That's literally the one thing I don't have at this store. And that's what you're looking for? That's fine. That's fine. I gotta stop getting angry at the customers. Hello, customer. Thank you so much for choosing the Nina Market. I don't know. That sounds too plain. Nina Market. I feel like we need something more luxurious, you know? Um, Marquette. <laughs> is, that, is that even... What is the French word for market? Marché. Just why not? Did I change? Thank you. What? Couldn't find the black tea. Everyone wants tea. Okay, wait, wait, give me a second. I'm gonna order it right now, okay? Give me un momento, por favor. I just need to order the tea. I have enough to purchase. There we go. I don't want no more people yelling at me about the tea, okay? Un momento, por favor. Dang, that's a lot of tea. That's a lot of tea. Let me, um, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta put the price too because people are crazy. There we go. There I go, rounding up in the... <laughs> Thank you. Okay, eight buckaroonies. Can people leave? Will people leave if um if I'm not if I keep them waiting long enough? I'm kind of scared about that actually. Awesome. And the tea. Got to finish up the tea. Can people steal? Can people steal? <laughs> Should I be concerned if people steal from me? If I like leave my store or if I leave boxes outside? Is this a good neighborhood? Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, and two dollars. There you go. Thank you. Awesome. Nobody can complain anymore, guys. Nobody can complain. 1999. What do I got for 19? Coffee 6.99. Wait a minute. Oh, you're you're selling a product without? Wait, wait. Oh no. Wait, 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 wait. I never said the coffee. Oh my gosh. I'm losing money on you. Oh my gosh, they are taking, they are snatching the coffee. They're like, this is perfect timing. And I'll give you a hundred dollar bill on top of that. Why? Oh my gosh, there you go. There you go. Okay, gotta definitely make sure to restock. Um, also, I got to make this place a little bigger. That's gonna be the next achievement. But I also have to save some money for tomorrow. I think I'm just gonna just gonna wait for tomorrow to stock everything up. That's something I didn't do before. Like I literally was like running around the market. Like like when we had people here, I'll be buying stuff, which you know doesn't make the best of sense. Thank you, thank you, thank you for your patronage. Thank you very much. But yeah, so far so good. This is great. I'm having a good time. Honestly, having a great time. Look, we got three people in here. And this place is only going to get bigger and better. Oh, man, I really do adore this game. This game is actually so awesome. Even though we're literally just sitting here chilling, um, you know, I'm literally playing a game working a regular job, you know? Oh, freak. These $100 bills 
why don't I, why don't they make it even more realistic and like give you like a marker to see if it's real or not, you know? <laughs> just, to, just to make it more realistic. Cause not gonna lie, that was the most mind, like the, the most nerve wracking part when I was a cashier. Getting a hundred dollar bill and seeing if it was real or not. But yeah, so far so good, we're doing amazing. I think getting that loan really did help a lot, even though, I mean, cause we gotta pay 30, to, 30 something dollars every day. And that's a small price to pay to like just get everything up and running in the very beginning. This is great, $41. You're our highest paying customer yet, thank you so much. What, what, what should I name you? Oh, well, he's gone, Never mind. <laughs> you will be forever remembered, my guy. Thank you, thank you. From the depths of my soul, I want to thank you. Okay, awesome. We racked up a lot of money. Oh, the oil's almost out. Okay, let me hurry up and order order the oil before. Wait, we should just wait for tomorrow. Honestly, like honestly. But I don't know if someone's gonna come in and ask for oil and be like, "There's no oil," because <laughs> they get so angry about like um you know you not having the supplies which you know i understand because i low-key would get the same way because <laughs> i'm like i go to some a place for one thing in particular and they don't have it i'll be like dang it i came all the way here and i thought that they would have it e i love it i love it the sweet smell of money ah you love the tea i love the tea I adore you guys. Thank you so much for coming in. I appreciate every single one of you guys. Thank you. Thank you. And that's it for today, guys. That is it for today. Um, tomorrow, we're gonna focus on restocking. We don't really need to restock today. Dang. Um, but yeah, so far, so good, guys. So far, so good. Let's go ahead and end the day. Awesome. And dang, supplies cost. All these reds, scary. But we're making a profit. We're slowly making a profit, guys. So that's all we, that's all that matters. That's all that matters. Let's go. Next day. Please, let's pay our bills, our rents. Uh, let's pay the, 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 the loan payments. Gotta make sure. Gotta make sure we pay that back or else, oof. They might come for my store and just take the whole thing, you know? Anyways, let's go ahead and grow it. I believe that's the next objective to purchase a new section. And let's go ahead and purchase. Oh, freight, 350. Oh man, I thought I had enough. Okay, no, not yet, not yet. Let's go ahead and restock our stuff. So we need two things of bread, one thing of oil, two things of sugar, one thing of flour. This is what my store is looking like. Let's go ahead and open up for the day. Come one, come all, the Nina Market is now open. Come fast because um, there's no promotion really, but it would make me feel a lot happier if you guys came really fast to my opening. Yes, let's go. Welcome to the store, you're the first customer. <laughs> yes, the, 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 the um, promotion worked guys, the promotion worked. Okay, but now we're gonna go ahead and try to get enough money so that we can upgrade the store. Like, push it, grow the store, push the walls back. And, um, don't mind the corner. Don't don't look at the corner that just has a bunch of stuff on the floor. Eventually, we'll unlock this storage. I never did, personally. I, I never personally unlocked the store. Honestly, as soon as we get that growth, that, that, that upgrade growth, where they, like, they make, they make the market a lot bigger that's when i would have caught it up to my old self <laughs> my other save file so let's go we got here a lot faster than the last time hello welcome welcome yes get as much stuff as you can and put it all on credits because that's what i do i mean no i don't do that you do that just kidding <laughs> but yeah almost done with the day um, I think in order to do the next objective, we need 300, 300, dang, that's a lot, that's a lot, not gonna lie, guys, ooh, you like that coffee, coffee is actually so expensive, why is the coffee $11, I mean, I know I made it that much, but why is it actually marketing price, $11, that's crazy, 
Hello. Wow, I love people that like is just coming out here to support small business. Eventually, it will be a big building and it will be the next Walmart. But Nina, you know, Nina-fied. Nina-fied Walmart. Can you guys see the vision? Can you see it now? Let's go ahead. Thank you, thank you. And it's 50 cents back. There you go. Awesome. And we are at 206. Almost there, guys. Almost there to upgrade the building. We just need more people coming in, guys. Come on. What, what, what's happening? Where, where's everyone at? Huh? Hello? I'm open. I'm open. <laughs> Imagine like someone's running a supermarket store or market store. I'm like, I'm open. Anybody wants to come in here? I'm open. <laughs> awesome. We got somebody in here. I like how they all come with their little bags already, like pre-made, and they just set it over here. Like, go ahead and bag it up for me. Love it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Give me that money. Awesome. Hey. And now they, that was the first time. We're not gonna lie. I was gonna say first time that someone got cereal. No, that's not the first time in a while. And we are at a hundred more. Come on guys, come inside. It is great. Oh, is it actually different times? There's more people that come through. I don't even think I noticed that the first time. Maybe everyone's coming on their like lunch break right now at four o'clock where people are getting out of classes and getting out of school, getting out of work around two. Yeah, it's the rush time coming through. I love it. I love to see it. Awesome. Thank you, thank you. 12 buckaroonies. Exact change. We love to see it. Awesome. Come on, guys. Let the rush begin. I wonder how hectic it's going to be once we make this like this store like super, super Walmart size, guys. I can only imagine. Because I did see over here that you're able to get like workers is what I think I saw. Hi you can hire people. Dang. Wow. Imagine, guys, imagine me, Nina, who literally just said that she can't manage nobody actually managing people. What? <laughs> no, I feel like they're going to low-key take advantage of me. They're like, oh, she's not repli reprimanting me. So I'm going to go ahead and... Oh, my gosh, the cheese is almost out. Dang, when did that happen? Go ahead and thank you. Thank you, exact change. Okay, we're gonna go ahead, grow, oh, not growth. We need to buy more cheese. Awesome. I'm just gonna go ahead and do that now before people uh, get upset that there's no cheese. Like, where's the cheese? It's coming up, coming up. Hey, lady. Okay, she got some bread, love to see it. Thank you, thank you. Dang. And like, I don't, I don't think I'll be able to grow it. I might not be able to grow it until tomorrow. Just because I have to like make sure to stock everything and then I gotta make sure that I would have enough for all the bills that I racked up, you know? Maybe, maybe if people got some high quality stuff, like a lot, a lot of food. Maybe, maybe. Anyways, awesome. Thank you, thank you. I like how there's a, like a lot of people in here that come with their suits on. Like they're coming straight from work. I remember you, you're the one who got the discounted coffee, was it? Yeah. Anyways, 50 cents, 50 cents back. There you go. Have an amazing rest of your day. Oh, we actually hit it. We actually hit it. Should I, oh no, but I don't know if I should buy it right now. The, the upgrade, just because I need to restock and I'll need to pay bills for tomorrow. I'll see actually, I'll see how much money I have tomorrow. Um. We'll see. We'll see how much money I have before I do the growth. You gotta make sure you have enough money first. You know, before you try and start upgrading and stuff. I'm very financially responsible, guys. I'm a financially responsible person is what I, at least what I try to tell myself. You know, I gotta speak it into existence. Thank you, thank you. 12 bucks. Give me a straight $40 bill. Dang. Thank you. Yeah, I'm making everything even numbers. It makes life so much easier. I don't have to do cents and stuff. Um, no change. Oh my gosh. I was literally about to give her $20. I gotta stop that habit. I gotta stop that habit. Anyways, it's almost time to close up at 9 o'clock. People are slowly stringing themselves in. I love it. I love it. Shop to your heart's content, guys. We're literally gonna be open. Um... 24 hours. I wonder if uh, that would be cool if I could do that, like just set it to 24 hours. But we can't, a normal human being can't work themselves that way though. And I think that's it. 
I think that's it. Unless somebody else comes in, I think that's it for the day. You want to come in? Hey, let's go! Last customer! Last customer! Like, oh my gosh, imagine how uncomfortable that would be if you actually was the last customer and like the, the, the cashier's just sitting there, last customer! Last customer! Yay! <laughs> Oh, I would never go back to that market ever again. Oh, you're the last customer. You're truly the last. Oh my gosh. I love that they're still coming in. I love it. I guess as long as my doors is open, you too can come inside my store. I love to see it. I love to see it. Okay, last customer. Come on. Go ahead so I can close up shop. I can pay my bills for tomorrow. I can grow the store. Awesome. 21 buckaroonies. Point 50. And I think he's truly the last customer. Unless someone else wants to come in here. No, there's not even anyone on the streets. You? No, they're across the street. How far out can I go? How far out can I go? I wonder. Is this... Can I... I, I can still go... What? What? Where am I going? Why do they make this place so huge? Wait. Why do they make this place so huge if it's literally just... I mean, unless I'm going to eventually take over this entire area. Is that, is that the end goal? To take over and be like, Deli, I'm coming for your space. Eventually, I will own everything the light touches. Is that, is, is that the goal? Is that my goal, guys? Okay, I think that's it. Nobody else came inside the store. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and end the day. Let's go ahead and end the day. Everyone was satisfied. Oh, I know how to satisfy my customers, guys. Let's freaking go. On to the next day. Even though I literally just said that the last day was going to be the, the last day. But I'm kind I really want to see if I'll have enough for everything. And then real quick, let me pay my bills. Let me pay my rent. Let me pay my loan. I do have enough for growth. I'm going to go ahead and do that. Go ahead and grow it up. Let's see. Let's see it. Ooh. You saw that, guys? You saw that? I just slowly took over. I should have looked outside first. I just slowly took over this other building. Dang. I wonder how big I can get in this game. I think I can go ahead and carry you over here in this corner. I can actually buy another shelf eventually because I'm going to need another shelf to put more products on it. Um, and I'll put you right here. All the frozen stuff will be over here. Wow. Look at this. This? Oh, I can carry this too? What? No, I'll leave you over here. I'll leave you right here in this little corner. Wow. Dang. Why do I low-key feel proud of myself, guys? Why low-key uh, low feel proud of myself? That my supermarket, the Nina supermarket or whatever name you guys, whatever creative name you guys come up with. Um, it's, it's looking good. It's shaping up really nicely. And honestly, if you guys would like to see like a long let's play of this or want to see more of it, I would be down. I would be down because like I kind of want to see how big this could get. Oh my gosh. Anyways, that's it gonna that's gonna get you didn't hear that. Anyways, that's gonna be it for me. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in my next video. Nina out.